Mr. DeFeo, the principal of Windsor High School, where Saborno was taking high school chemistry classes, and Mr. Villafana, his region's chemistry teacher, gave Saborno a warm welcome at Windsor. You're going to be famous? Saborno received permission from New York State to finish the high school curriculum in two years. So I've got a difference of seven between trial one and trial two with acetic acid, and I've got a difference of ten for trial one and trial two in sodium uh, in hydrochloric acid. Okay. Oh man. All right, then so. I believe a single replacement is ta uh, be uh, taking place here, where is magnesium it? sulfate is being formed and hydrogen gas is being released. You are correct. Okay. Oh, wait. I should probably put this in the Rinser. No. Hold on. I should get a. Oh, no. Did I, did I contaminate this stuff? No, this is water. That's how rinse water. What did you dip that into? Sorry, you're gonna find out. Hey, what is this precipitating? Is that ma uh, magnesium sulfate? And the copper two sulfate, what is that stuff? It doesn't look like precipitate. It looks like just... Regular salt? Well, you form copper. That just seems to, all that black is black pieces of copper. Oh, okay. That's what that is. There should be a color change. There will be if you add enough drops. Okay. Three, two, one. Twenty four. drops. No, it's not do what we did before. Let's not assume that this is. Two. Yeah, but this is sorry, my drops are. It's a no color change. Did you add phenothalin? Oh no, maybe. Ten-year-old Saborno Isaac graduated from Howard T. Herber Middle School. He is expected to graduate from Malvern High School in two years. In 2024, twelve-year-old Saborno would expect to get accepted to all eight Ivy League schools. I met my favorite fourth grade teacher, Miss Beaumont. Hi everyone, I'm Miss Beaumont. Um, it was a pleasure to teach Saborno this year. We had so much fun in fourth grade. We did a lot of science experiments. We made yogurt parfaits. We had field day. We just had so much fun, and it was great to see Saborno grow and thrive throughout the year with his um, classmates. I can't wait to see all the wonderful things you do in the future, and I am so blessed that I had the pleasure of teaching you this year. Thank you. Hello, Professor Barry, how are you? I'm so pleased that you're in the Malvern School District and you're doing so well. We're looking forward to seeing you in the high school next year where you'll take on some advanced courses and hopefully graduate in another two years. You're brilliant and I hope you keep up all the good work that you're doing. Warner, we're so proud of you. Good luck in the high school next year, all right? Thank you, Mr. Nelson. Saborno Barry. Congratulations, Saborno. Great job. Congratulations on your graduation today. Malvern High School principal, Dr. Vincent Romano, we're looking forward to having you at our school. It's going to be a privilege and an honor for you to excel and take advantage of all the opportunities we have to offer. And I know you're going to do just that. Support Malvern High congratulations. We are so incredibly proud of you. And we're even more proud to help support you. In all my years being a counselor, about 20 years, I have never had a student as smart as you. Bruno was a good student first period. Uh, he always had his hand up ready to answer. He was just a good 
good classmate. So Gordon will be very smart. He knows a lot. And like, he's very smart. Congratulations. Here. You know what's a good way to hook your reader? Um, first of all, use a bunch of extravagant words. And let me just tell you, Suborno's writing was extravagant. Beautiful. Hey, you're stealing my word. Oh, sorry. <laughs> instead of you, use another one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, instead of extravagant? Yeah. How about impeccable? All right, good enough. Dr. Romano, the principal of Malvern High School, and Miss Gotsman, the director of school counseling at Malvern High School, gave Suborno a warm welcome this morning. During this visit, Malvern High School students challenged Suborno with spelling and math problems. Come here, I got this. Oh, let's see, let's see. Oh, you can spell automatopia. O N O. Wait. O N O M A T O P O E I A. Can you define that word just so I learn I, as we go? It's like uh, when a character says, I think, like uh, in the comic books, it's like what crack, snap. Oh, uh, like, like, a, like an emphasis. Like spell yeah. ha spell Hagerty. Um, H A N D. K-E-R-C-H-I-E-F. Wow. <laughs> 87. 87 times 74, you yes. said. Yeah, 87 times 74. Yes. Yeah, 87 times 74. No pressure. They don't rush. Got all there. Oh, no, my God, I'm, I'm like, I know. Yeah, that's, 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 that's good enough. That's good enough. I ain't gonna lie. I wouldn't have gotten, like, I wouldn't have gotten the. Uh,